All right, so here today we got some pretty fun stuff to talk about. As you all know, it's basically been about one year uh, since we've been kind of waiting for this thing. Um, this is something that was promised back then. It was like the biggest, probably empty promise of this game's history. Uh, they said that like, they were going to really bring this back to life and fix things and revamp things. And they released one of it and then gave up. Uh, as you all know, Alexa sort of leaked this back like a week ago, uh, saying basically what we kind of know now as you know citrus coming whatever whatever uh we will see how true that is soon but i'm gonna kind of state that that is sort of true it's either that or rain rock coming soon so it's one of the two but um as of right now alexis hasn't even like uh, leaked the entire thing so i don't know if he doesn't know what it is or if he's just not there to leak it <laughs> it's one of those two things right uh but he always knows what it is i just think that he's not there right now so with that being said uh we'll talk about it here today again remember it's it's either one of these two things being rag or uh kata correct and it's been one year since then so this is what to expect in the upcoming update remember stream is only a few days away so stay tuned for that so first things first what are we talking about as you all know the leaks were pointing towards citri being the character that meaning you will officially get your second chapter of oc story one year later bro one year and a little extra which is obs uh, it's obscene how bad that is it goes to show they just don't give a damn with the story um they released it last year it was I did the math. I already showed you. It, this was officially the worst performing update in Grand Cross history. Uh, we actually blew that away. Now that uh, TOG is the worst update ever, but um, they're close. They're close. <laughs> TOG got a little bit of a, a head start in a way, but um, remember also that uh, it's a collab, so it's three characters. But um, yeah, this was the official worst update in history. Uh, why was it the worst update in history? It performed the worst. Players just didn't care for the character. Uh, they didn't summon for the character. The revenue was just abysmal. And it was also sort of, there was there was some drama around it, if you remember. Uh, they never voice acted the entire story. So it was just like very awkward talking, uh, like with mouths and that's it. Like just mouthing the words. <laughs> it's very weird. But um, I was actually kind of hyped for Catastrophe to get a story. Um, I like Riding Rock and all. It's a great story. I'm not saying anything there, but I did think that catastrophes would have been cool to get, you know, entire like story and everything. Um, but sadly, they didn't put like the kind of. It's good as a story. The effort was there, but it goes to show that we didn't get a story for one year, and uh, voice acting wasn't in the first story. Maybe they took all this time to get voice acting done and get everything like perfectly ironed out uh, to re-release it. I'm hoping that that is the case. When we see this, we get like fully voice acted story. But if not, you understand why. Um, they did kind of focus more so on Ragnarok this year, uh, releasing, again, very solid Ragnarok stuff and a full-blown Ragnarok festival. Um, so whatever it is, that's there. And on top of that, you are getting a Ragnarok beast soon. It's like they've put out more Ragnarok content than they ever did OC content, which is the fact of the century. <laughs> it's very true. Um, but we'll see what exactly happens here. Uh, but yeah, after one year, you're officially getting your next chapter, most likely. Imagine they just did this to release an OC, but not actually release the story. That will be wild, but um, in this update, it's not like the best of the best updates. Again, it's very, it's kind of mediocre, right? This time, we're going to probably get Citri as the character. Apparently, she's leaked. Apparently, it's not her. It's a, it's the red one. I have no idea, bro. I'll just go with it, all right? But again, uh, we're going to have chapter two. It's going to be sort of pushing on the entire story. Um, we don't know who they're going to aim for this time. Roxy was the main focus of last chapter, but Roxy got a brand new unit. So who's the main focus of chapter two, given... None of the characters are getting a new unit. Uh, maybe they tease like Awakened Chin or something. But um, as of right now, we still don't have our Awakened variants to many characters. Uh, last year, you did get Relics. We'll see what happens this year if, if we actually get Relics. Uh, they've been very lazy this year uh, when it comes to releasing multiple Relics per update. Um, they have, and you, you know that for a fact. So we'll see if we do get one. Very unlikely, actually. I'm being very honest here. Uh, when it comes to the character skins, you'll obviously get three skins. It's a waifu character, so prepare for pretty solid, decent skins. Um, bundles, as always, that's going to probably happen. Uh, they did quality of life last year. Uh, this year, they currently haven't hyped up any quality of life. All they've hyped up so far is the fact that we're going to get a boss. We might get the Demon Beast this time, so again, be prepared for that. Um, again, most of us can't beat it for like six months until they release a character, so there's also that. Um, content reorganization, remember that? That's happening soon. They're going to reorganize everything. They want to revamp the entire game. They don't know when. Again, that's planned. But by the anniversary, which is in May, around that point is when it's going to be all done. Uh, none of this is planned for March, but around, again, April into May, that's their entire goal um, to kind of get this all uh, solidified and organized. So remember, it's a huge revamp to the game coming soon, but as of right now, it's not there yet. New Demonic Beast is planned. That's, again, between March and April. We don't know yet the confirmed you know, thing if it's March, uh, March or April. Can't speak March or April, but we will see. Next, they're supposed to be at some point a user survey. 
That was supposed to be conducted in March. So I'm guessing with this update, we're going to get a brand new user survey. And I'm guessing it's going to be from the actual stream that's going on or going to go on basically this week. Correct? Right, because we're going to get a stream. Be ready for that. And on that stream, I'm guessing they're going to announce that, yeah, we have a, a survey. Please uh, properly do the survey. I'm hoping they at least ask, like, we have these options for collaboration. Which collab do you want? And then I hope the community has some brain cells to vote for a good collab. And then when we get that collab, they then co not complain about it, right? Because I still remember, whatever it is, Shield Hero, there were so many people complaining. Overlord, there was still a, <laughs> a decent amount complaining. It's like, bro, we've, we've had some decent collabs, but it never makes the community happy, I'm telling you. And Overlord should have been like your pinnacle collab. Albedo was the most busted character in the world and players skipped her and then proceed to comment on every video saying, when is she returning? Don't, don't skip a collab. <laughs> I hope we learn that right now. Uh, but yeah, that's what it currently looks like. But we will see what happens here with the user survey. I'm hoping for some good stuff here. And I'm hoping they listen to it. I will be honest with you. They listened last time. I don't care what anybody says. Uh, they definitely listened to the last user survey, which uh, basically told, uh, we, like we told them, you need to up like the, the banner variant, right? Like it's, it's dog crap what you're putting on there. And you shouldn't be just putting seasonals on seasonals. You should mix and match correct and in the last like year and this year you've seen clearly that seasonals keep popping up on non-seasonal banners which is good for the game so hopefully that uh like stuff like that gets revamped and they listen to us on those on those fronts but we shall see how that works but more quality of life more quality of life more quality of life uh, they give away like a multi system this was the most moronic thing uh 2023 had some very dumb changes and this was one of them this happened like three times in 2024 uh where they put the summons across this many days so you had to wait till 10 days to get your free multi and then you had four extra singles i still think on my global account i have those four singles sitting there because i'm like i'm not going through those four singles i'm not getting anything <laughs> what is the point but um you should get a free multi as always um we don't know about those extra things right uh, we haven't gone to that one catastrophe event back in like forever where it gives us gems correct like the one with camilla and everything uh, so we will see if that pops up you'll always get this stuff over here um this thing again same event as usual same event uh this was the disaster battle i'm talking about uh but we haven't gotten it in one year <laughs> catastrophes literally have gotten nothing in the game um so i'm expecting to see this return uh this time i'm guessing citri is one of the bosses because again easton was one of the bosses um, so we will see how that turns out. It does give you a decent amount of gems, so it's kind of a nice event. And they're probably just going to rerun it this year. They're going to bring back these skins that they haven't already, uh, again, for this year. So keep that in mind. Um, there was this last year they had, again, some decent things kicking up. It was like a diamond perk event. If you summoned, you can actually get a ticket over here to select one of these heroes. And Freyr was on there. So it was not a bad ticket, genuinely speaking. But that was it. That was the update, right? Um, so it's not again gonna be like the best of the best updates. It's definitely one of the uh, it's one of the updates of all time. Keep that in mind. But um, it should still be decent for what it is. It's like the anniversaries and festivals have become the same thing every time. Uh, it's just like a 600 banner and a small little you know event on the side. So just know that now. But banner wise, it's gonna be catastrophe heavy and maybe some right and rock characters on there. Again, not like the most craziest um banner out there we just had a crazy banner right whatever it was i uh, would gild us so i'm expecting a very mediocre banner too uh, so don't expect much on that front but basically that's what we're expecting this upcoming update it's catastrophe heavy it's going to be the entire release potentially of the story i'm hoping they learned and decided to you know buff um the game or buff the story with 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 you know the wonderful uh, voice acting which you know every event has everything has would be very wonderful but again it's been one year we'll see if that was the reason the one year thing happened um or if they just didn't do anything <laughs> over the course of this time but um they were saying like this stuff is ready to go so it's like what were you doing for one year that's the, the way they hyped it up was that this stuff was like ready to go back then um so i'm wondering if they still actually like mean that in a way you know what i mean like don't you have like chapter three four five developed by now if this was ready back then with like, way in advance um I'm, I'm guessing they didn't correct that's like my thought process but uh we shall see we shall see but just want to show it to you real quick just to show you like again evidence basically uh where's roxy transcendent bond uh where is it this collab there we go roxy <laughs> it's been one year bro oh my god that's crazy but yeah take care have fun we'll see what happens so hopefully it's the uh it's a good update hopefully all right all right take care